another edition of the Hollywood Video High Five Challenge. I'm your host, Wayne Faligowski. We're not very far away from the playoff rounds, and those are the most exciting, but we've had some exciting matches already this regular season. Let's see if we have another match today just like those. So let's meet today's two teams. First, from Glendale for their second appearance, the Glendale High Pirates. Come on on, guys and gals. Okay, they look pretty pumped. Okay, and their opponents from Milwaukee High, the Fishermen. When we last left these two teams, Ilwaka was in the lead with 2,160 points, Glendale trailing with 1,990. But don't forget, we have 10 more categories, so you can still catch up. Okay, let's check the first five categories for today. They will be deserts, music, famous Americans, courts, and math. Let's go to that first category. Okay, we'll start off with music. Good luck to both teams. For 10 points, Antonio Vivaldi was a virtuoso with this instrument. That is the violin. Music for 10 points. This high-kicking dance is popular in French music halls, such as the Follies Berger. A steal by Iwako. Our first steal of the round for Sarah from Iwako's side. Okay. Can-can? Yes, the can-can. Very good. Music for 40 points. This virtuoso was born in Northern Ireland and is perhaps the world's best known flautist. That is James Galway. Music for 20 points. Apparently not that famous. 20 points. Name the form of music that is a form of prayer consisting of a series of petitions sung by a priest or cantor to which the congregation repeats a fixed response. A steal by Iwako. Okay, Sarah's going to steal it again from Iwako's side. Okay, talk it over. Okay, come around here, Sarah. A chant? That is incorrect, Iwako. Okay, Glendale, three seconds. No talking, please. Remember, this is not a discussion. Okay, Nova. Gospel? That is incorrect as well. It's called a litany. Music for 20 points. This orchestral rhapsody, as Gershwin called it, about a visitor to France, was scored for a large orchestra plus four automobile horns. Ilwako. Okay, Kara. Uh, Rhapsody in Blue. That is incorrect, Ilwako. Okay, Glendale. I'll give you three seconds. That was an American in Paris. Okay, let's go to the next category. Famous Americans. Hopefully it's better than famous music. Famous Americans for 20 points. Mary McCauley earned this legendary nickname at the Battle of Monmouth. Ilwako. Kara. Bloody Mary. That is incorrect, Ilwako. Okay, Glendale, three seconds. <laughs> that was Molly Pitcher. Famous Americans for 40 points. This director of the CIA died before the extent of his involvement in the Iran-Contra affair was fully known to the American people. That was William Casey. Famous Americans for 10 points. Abby Hoffman, Jerry Rubin, Tom Hayden, David Dillinger, Rennie Davis, John Frones, and Lee Weiner were collectively known as this group. There were seven of them called the Chicago Seven. Famous Americans for 20 points. He became vice president and then president of the United States without being elected to either position. That was Gerald Ford. And famous Americans for 10 points. He was the American president at the time of VJ Day. That was Harry Truman. Okay, we're gonna take a break. When we come back, we'll meet the pirates of Glendale after these messages.